Yes, it's finally Christmas, our favorite time of the year. Playing games, laughing, and having a good time with friends. Or even better, watching a new DBK video. Hey guys, oh sorry I didn't see you there. Today we're going to talk about the best knife in the world, the Malanica Pruko. No Mickey, it's the Aurora CPM 3V. What do you mean? You think that that knife can win from this knife? Well of course it can. Mickey. 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 I thought you never stopped singing. My knife, my knife, my knife is the best. Oh, how much I love my knife, and it will win all the test. Merry Christmas, ladies and gentlemen, from the boys of DBK. Uh, it doesn't really sound really tough. Uh, uh. Merry Christmas, uh, ladies and gentlemen, from the warriors of DBK. And this has been one of the most, one of the craziest years out of our whole lives. And yeah. thank you all so much for the support. And we hope you have a very nice Christmas. Yeah. And, and New uh, Year. And don't die. Let's make 2018 worthwhile. Yeah. Yeah. Christmas has arrived, and it's time for a wonderful Christmas carol. This is a story about two knife heroes. Mickey B and Martin. They both had a huge collection of knives. With a constant desire to get the best knife in the world, they both had their own favorite. Mickey B had the heavenly Milani Capuco and CPM 4V, and Martin the almighty Bob Ripple Aurora. This is a story about the best knife in the world. I guess it's just one way to find out which arm is the best. Yeah, I I'm listening. I'm listening. And so Mickey taught Martin the test they were about to do to find out which of their favorite knives is the best. Hey. Sounds like a plan, Mickey. But remember, you stand no chance. First, let's take a look at the knives they will be testing. Malani Capuco featuring CPM 4V steel, Buckeye wood, and a high Scandinavian grain. And of course, a Bog River Aurora in CPM 3V with a natural canvas handle. So, I guess the winner of this beauty contest is. Me! Mickey B. Damn it! If you think you can take me on Okay I will beat you Tell her baby All day long Mickey shot your face ah, come on man I don't think you know your place Well I do I'll beat you so hard you don't even know you're a part of the human race Godly knives, godly knives Making history You better not think you can beat my cast to win It's gonna be me Godly knives, godly knives Making history you better not think you can beat my girls to win, it's gonna be me! It was now time for our young hero Martin to get his revenge. The next test was going to be... Wound splitting! Martin clearly was 
winning this test and nobody could do a thing about it. It batons like a beast, handles hard use like a champion, and really was basically being a true legendary knife. But as time went on, it got colder, and Marta began to feel the steel of the full tank being exposed to his hand. Oh, I can really feel the steel of the tank exposed to my hand. They really needed to make a fire, and quick, because Mickey was starting to get really cold. Our young hero was suffering, because he forgot to wear his warm and especially good looking DBK jumper. Get up, Mickey! Get up and show Martin what you've got! <laughs> don't make me laugh! You don't have what it takes! Suddenly a spark! A fire lit up in Mickey's little heart! <gasps> don't you ever tell me that my knife does not have what it takes! And so Mickey grabbed his knife and feather stick the wound leaving all other knives in its shadow. Feather sticking, wood scraping, fire steel scraping, and even cutting. This was a true winner. And it did not matter how much Martin tried, his knife lost the battle. And with that, it's pride. He tried and he tried, but all went in vain. He did give a fight, but lost once again. Laughed the blonde angel. It looks like I have won this battle. <sighs> Our no. young hero was absolutely Mr. devastated. Albert. He did not know what to do now that he has lost everything. It must be. Or so he thought. Hmm. Mickey can't cook. Mickey! I challenge you to a cook off! Shit! That's my weakness! <laughs> And so on this Christmas day, our two heroes went head to head to win the last challenge. But turning once more, making fire once more and prepping the food with their beloved knives. Mickey was now all alone, without food and the best knife in the world. But Martin's heart warmed up. <sighs> you know, Mickey, the young hero said, Nobody should be alone on Christmas. Christmas time is the only time we pretend to love each other and care about peace. You shouldn't be eating alone, man. <laughs> <laughs>
You know what, Martin? You're right, man. I mean, we shouldn't be fighting. We should be working together on making this world a better place by fighting darkness with love. Or at least pretend that like everybody else is doing on Christmas. Merry Christmas, Mickey. Merry Christmas, Martin. And that's how it is, ladies and gentle people. That's how the story ends of the two knife heroes in the forest. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. From the BBK, and it was this was our Christmas special, Martin. Yeah, Christmas is the I'm most pretty... wonderful time. It's my favorite time of the year. Yeah. And we want to thank you all for your amazing support. As we said early on in this video, and um, and we really want to do a huge and shout out to the number one knife shop in in our opinion, and that is Knives and Tools. Unbelievable that support for us this year, and um, they have a very great Christmas sale. And I want to point you something out. Look, listen, these knives are, have such great steels, and what I love about these great steels is that the only thing you need to do with them is. 95% of the time you only need to strop them. Yeah, because of the amazing air retention. Yeah. CPM 3V and CPM 4V. Woo! Oh my god, and, and that's the whole thing. You don't really need to sharpen these knives on stones a lot if yep. you've got a go good strop and some good compound. And this week, Knives and Tools has got a Christmas sale and they are selling this for, with a good discount. So I would yep. say go buy that Skirper strop at Knives and yep. Tools, link in the, the description. Viking. We did a battle between these two knives and if you if you would need one knife, of course the Aurora would be a better knife because if you find yourself in a survival situation, yeah, it's just you, don't, all you don't really want a knife like this. I mean, it's it's really good, but the Aurora can do everything because it's a beast. Yeah, yeah. and it's good. At, it can do everything, but this is better in, uh, for bushcraft and yeah, small, small tasks yeah. and carving and stuff, yeah. you know? But this is a specialized knife and this is for all yeah. of us. All and ladies and gentlemen, some other people who I'd really like to thank before Christmas yeah. is uh, our new Patreon supporters. Every it's month, a giant list. Every month we do a Patreon giveaway and this month we are giving away um, my Aurora. Yeah, yeah a, a knife only a few days left to enter. Yeah, only a few days left, but um, check out Patreon, link in the description as well. Yeah. These are the new participants. Roy, Jesper W, Thor Hendrickson M, Cody K, Matt H, Eric Haw, Brian F, Daniel D, KCL, Arian DJ, Andrew S, Big Tony, Randall K, Oscar J, Josh P, Nathan F, Christopher K, Greg B, Andreas K, Marcus J, Patrick S, John D, Jeremy T, Francois A, Matthew R, Aureline, Drinkwe, L, Hanno B, Robin W, Dibuchem, Even I, Leonard B, Robert P, Aaron F, Travis H, That Irish Sob, Hank W, Nick D, Eric E, Jake H, Jason C, Andrew H, Outdoor Runaway, Stephen P, Dolph S, The Tennessee D, Sergio E D, Patrick S, David A, and last but not least, Michael H. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Check us out on Patreon if you want to participate. Please, in the please, giveaway. do, please. Check out our Instagram. Uh, don't forget to hit the post notification button. Please do 10,000 likes minimum. Yeah, minimum. And uh, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and see you in the next episode. Please Bye. do see you.